Good morning. This is some advertising for Lingon Silk, which we have on our porridge, oatmeal porridge. And we're having breakfast, uh, the, our last day in Scotland in the Outer Hebrides. Yeah. Because we it's will uh, sail away. Mm -hmm. Today we will head out to Europe. No, I mean, uh, we will head up to um, Faroe Islands. Faroe. It's almost Denmark. Yeah, we could say that. Mm -hmm. But, um, and we are leaving in the evening mm. because it's a one and a half day sail. Mm -hmm. We could go all early bird the next day, but then we might not. We get the, yeah. we get better winds if we leave now. Oh, well, I mean, or, in, the, in the evening. Yeah, it mm -hmm. could be really strong in the end and we not might make it to before dark and the wind comes. All the way to Tursan. Yeah, yeah, because we want to go all the way to Tursan. Mm. And uh, therefore we do it, and then it will be two nights in one day. Mm. Now I will put on my seasickness. Plaster. You're preparing yourself, not only I, the boat. Not only the boat, I'm preparing myself and the way I prepare myself is not to get seasick. When we go for only during the day it's it's no um, problem, but uh, when we go for the nights I'd like to be um, of use. I'm not just lying in my cabin reading my book all the time. You're not selling yourself as a woman that just laying in the bed all the time. <laughs> Why do you want to use this? I want to use it because uh, uh, when you, we, when you, we travel during the night, I get uh, I get seasick. During the daytime, it's okay, but because uh, I can focus on the horizon. Yeah. But at night, it is not the same. But you used to be a much more seasick than you are now. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm yeah, you have come a long way. Now all I need to be is a technician to get into this. I um, I always have a bit of a trouble, and then all of a sudden it's just gets loose and there then I'm thinking hmm, how did I do that mm. but uh, your seasickness I, I remember the days when you were seasick when boiling egg <laughs> I remember just staying on the boat at the pontoon thinking that I got gast gastritis or something like that and no I was seasick <laughs> well, so you have come a long way. I have come a long way, yes. How does it go for you there with uh, the plaster? It is, uh, it is um, a wee little thing to get into and um, oh, this is so silly, it is so easy all the time. So then I uh, try to take away my hair and then I find a, a bony spot here. And a bony spot? Yes, and that's where it, it is uh, the closest to uh, the the blood vessels, mm -hmm. which have, is needed. Have you put it on already? Yeah, 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 it's ah. super, super easy. Can we see it? And, uh, yeah, there it is. So, uh, it needs to be on a bony spot because it needs to get into uh, the, the circulation of the blood, otherwise yeah. it doesn't do any good. Yeah. So, uh, I am preparing some uh, food for our two nighters over to uh, uh, Torsam. And, uh, I think it's going to be uh, some pasta salad with uh, halloumi, no, 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 um, pasta salad with mozzarella and feta cheese, pasta, the calamates and in the pasta bolognese I would have some fennel as well and I will also make some popcorn. So I hope we are going to enjoy this and uh, the other day I actually made some uh, Cornish pastry. Well, you can't say it is Cornish pastry, can you? But it is some kind of pastry with uh, a minced meat in one and bacon and cheese in the other. And a one stock fridge. We're not going to starve on this trip anyway. We are filling up the freezer. We went shopping a little bit uh, before we're leaving. I'm preparing some food, bolognese as usual, pasta salad, and then we can go. 
We are uh, preparing to leave, We're taking off a few fenders and uh, we will disconnect uh, the electricity but as the same as we arrived uh, we will have to wait for a ferry before we can go but uh, it's all right we are on our time schedule anyway leaving in the rain there is Ronja Nordic and some fishing boats on the way out here Are, are you happy with your new uh, overall? Yeah. It's the best thing the, ever. The flood and rescue system. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it costs like a tenth of, a, of what your Musto costs. Yeah. But my Musto is like seven years old anyway. Yeah, but this is something else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's warm, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Sailing in these waters uh, where we've been in the winter, I would not have consider anything else. Now I know about these things. The sails are up. How are you doing back there? How much wind is it? 24. 24 knots. We have full main and the jib. Stay safe. Stay safe, yes. And uh, yeah. We are quite... We are doing eight and a half to nine. Eight and a half to nine, yeah. That's not too bad. So maybe we are there too early then. Yeah. But I think it's a mistake, you know? Yeah, probably. We'll see. Or we have to slow down. Birds and see the sun Side by side our fears are done All the good times just begun Oh, we know what we have Let's hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life Call us crazy But things are finally right the future is but we will go like this and then the wind will come and then we'll come up there we have a quite okay wind now but it's supposed to go down during the night and uh, yeah there you can see butt of Lewis Like a great. 
gray day. Good morning. Sorry. Good morning. It's oh. time to wake up. Oh. It's your watch. Are you sleeping well? No. I sleep very well. Mm. And, and the wind turned exactly at the point. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> it was scary. Yeah. Mm. I think you can put on the heater. It is on. Oh, it is. So Frederick has uh, gone off uh, the night shift, and uh, are you enjoying your book? Yes. Mm. It's another Peter May. Uh -huh. Rannish Tweed. Oh, that's the one about the tweed industry here, uh, well, in uh, Outer Hebrides, on Lewis and Harris. Yeah, mm. which we just left. Which we just left, yeah. But I started a book there, mm. so it was good. Mm. And now I try to finish it. I'm envious of those who still have their Peter Mays to read. Mm. Yeah. You too, huh? Well, have a nice one. Thank you. So, just a bit uh, foggy out here. I'm not too sure if you could see it on the film, but over there is the tanker, which we're keeping an eye on. And I think the tanker is keeping an eye on us too, because uh, changed his uh, Now that the mist has lifted a little, little bit, you can uh, clearly see the ship uh, It didn't look that you had any uh, cargo. It looks empty. It looks very empty, yeah. yeah. It was a wee bit nervous. You so were a little nervous there. Yes, I, 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 I know I can trust my, my instruments and everything, but still he got really close. Hmm. You didn't talk to him? No. It's blowing quite hard now. It's uh, gusty. Quite uncomfortable. 